Hey, I got one for you here. I've got a, a major crack on a ceiling. This is where somebody got up in the attic and stepped on the drywall and uh, made this heavy duty crack about six feet long. First thing you're gonna wanna do is get your razor knife and you, you cut a, a channel into along the line of the crack. Next thing you do is you get your stud finder and you find out where the studs are. And like I did, I've already done this previously it lights up right here and I have had made made markings on the ceiling with my pencil and so you can see where that studs at and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna drop screws in to the stud on each side of the crack everywhere that I can find a stud and so I've already did it on these three studs unfortunately these are 24 inches on center uh, I really like to see them at 16 inches on center, but this is critical. I don't know if you saw that pull the drywall tight, but now we have a tighter surface and that drywall is not going to be moving around. Now we lay the tape. I've pre-cut this tape to length and this is a more of a heavy duty drywall tape. And my buddy Jack from Jack's Drywall Repair turned me onto this one a couple years ago and so you lay this tape boom okay you could also put a little mud into that V before you lay the tape but it will smush through the tape which is what I'm gonna do and you just disperse your mud along I'm gonna, this is pre-mixed 45 minute mud I use either 45 minute, it sets up in 45 minutes, or I do the 20. And this is the initial bed coat. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna let this dry. I'm gonna put another coat on. I'm gonna let that dry to a fine sand, and I'm gonna put another coat on of another compound, which is an easier sanding compound. Yeah, this this 45 minute has a little chemical additive to it, which helps it dry a little faster, a little harder. So what I'm doing here is I'm just getting the tape on here to stick. I'm doing a very thin coat. I really want this, I want it thin because I want this to dry quick. So I can get back at it and put another coat on it, probably within the hour. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna set up a fan and that's gonna kick this patch into drying faster and get my additional coats on. I'm gonna do my fine sand after three to four coats and it'll be ready for primer and then ready for paint. So good luck on all your painting projects.